Oh, look, it's the last bandit crew. They're about to find out that they don't have any friends anymore. All right, into the mine. Oh, what is going on here? Do we have... Are these Mormons or something? Can I take your ore? Oh, yeah, we can take their ore. That's great. Or maybe Amish. He's already burning, so we'll just give him a nice ping. And the follow-up on instinctive throw. A little bit of burning. Oh, there were... Uh... Oh, cool. <laughs> Cone of Doom, right there. Looks like the bear gets to go. Ne just kidding. Oh, there we <laughs> Oh my god. All right, there it is. We did it. Yay. Mercenaries. You've unlocked the title the Beastmaster. So we get 200 Beast gold. Challenge. You've won all of our prizes. Oh, <laughs> they have nothing else. Okay, they legit have nothing else. We literally took them for all they're worth. Wow, that's great. So currently, as we zoom on out, we are now bordering on level 10. We're like 9, 10. We leveled up maybe three to four times in Vertrus, which was kind of obscene. There are other places to go. As I understand it, this is a lower area. This is sort of like a middle-ish area. There's an Arena of Legends here. There's the Pirates, which I don't think we're ready for yet. That's supposed to be endgame. And then I think these two are kind of the higher zones. We could go for either a tour of all the arenas. We could kind of migrate over to a new region where we're like more level appropriate. I, I don't know where, which one that is. Or we can stay and clear where we're at. So I'm going to toss out a poll. Grind the easy stuff for cash and experience. For me, I totally am fine with that. I just don't know if the it's boring for the bunnies. I didn't realize that we were that strong. So I just wanted to throw that out there so that you at least have an opportunity. Start thieving and run from the law. Ooh, that's interesting. I know that the law, they actually scale with us so they could totally whoop our butts. That's another one, yeah? How do the bunnies feel about that? We can try and pick a fight. Finish Ludern is currently in the lead. So that might be kind of fun. I'd, I haven't really made a point of antagonizing the lawman. Ooh, training dummy. Yes. Oh, that's going to be great. Oh, there it is. So what's the deal with this? You can assign one person. Your human companions gain 5% more experience in battles. We kind of had to restart Sukalanti's character. So he's the lowest level character. So let's get him the extra experience. I think that is fantastic. Bunnies, thank you so much for weighing in. We shall continue in Ludern. And also, maybe we'll get... We'll pick a few fights here and there, yeah? Thank you for that idea. I didn't that didn't even occur to me as an option. That is a fantastic idea. Are there any recipes we need here? Trapper fondue. Sure, we shall grab it. I believe this is now one skull, so we can try and take on the watchtower. That'll be great. And we also need to keep an eye out for a golden key because if I recall last time the Oh no, I don't want zombies. Uh, you know, the one thing we don't want are zombies. Oh, there's mosquitoes. Oh, Tug Bobo is now stung. Oh, we're out of fat We're fatigued. Holy crap. <laughs> well, that was embarrassing. That's fine. Poor Tug. Tug just has a... He's got an injury. He's been stung by a giant mosquito the size of a man. Big mosquito sting. Strength and dexterity reduced by 30%. Oh, my God. Well, let's use the flaw. Oh, flawed remedy worked that time. Heck yes, that's awesome. Breaking the law. Yeah, that's right. We're going to break the law. We just have to figure out the best way to do so. Should we? Oh, God. You know, attack. Why don't you attack the merchants? Why are you attacking us? Oh, are we stuck? How are we stuck? No. Uh, that's cool. We're fighting zombies. You spin me right round, baby. Right round. <laughs> oh, they're demoralized. Sure. I don't want to fight zombies anymore. <laughs> we haven't done this yet. This is like a thousand or fifteen hundred. We still owe crowns. You know what? Screw it. We're going to do it. We've never done a post. I don't know what this is. This travel post will be up and running in no time. It will? What's that mean? Oh my god, this guy's the fastest worker ever. What is this? So, uh, this is a lot of stuff. Manage a garrison. Oh, garrison's here. We can put people in a local garrison. Is this to defend enemies? Like if I put Sukalanti, free space. Oh, we lost him. Add to the troop. Oh, wow. This is very intense. When you unlock the post, you can fast... Oh, you can fast travel? Okay, that's huge. That's pretty darn huge. It's to make your group smaller. Oh! Oh! <gasps> They've got venison. They have white leather for gold. Oh, my God. Well, we can definitely get croc swine. Oh, we're low on gold right now. We should probably sell some things. What could we sell? I know. We're kind of heavy, right? We can go wait. And we can sell off shrooms. 
I mean, if you think about it, Raven finds truffles everywhere. She's a truffle boar, after all. Are we? Oh, we're not quite there yet. Well, we'll come back to that. <laughs> and what is this? Ooh, travel post chest. So we have a chest in camp and it does not reduce our weight. Does this reduce our weight? Because that would be worth 1500. If I stick this in, it does go down. Oh my gosh. Sweet baby Jesus. This changes everything. So right now we're down to 368. I mean, that's a big improvement from basically needing another horse, right? So that's awesome. It costs food and money to fast travel. Oh, that's not that bad. We actually have food and money. Oh, well, not right now, but... And you think we should be astounded by the fact you carry tons and tons of food around? No, no, not at all. Well, here's the thing. I mean, everybody, every bunny carries a lot of food because after all, we're a hungry, hungry group. In fact, our favorite game as kids, probably Hungry Hungry Hippos. 25 balls total for Hungry Hungry. Oh, you remember the number of balls? That's amazing. Movement speed 20% faster on trade routes. Wow. Retrieving companions and items is free from connected travel posts. Very cool. Peddlers sell resources from connected regions and suspicion decreases 15% faster. Oh. Oh man, that's important. All right, that's a piece of useless trivia that can potentially win you the game. Really? Because, oh, I see, because you need the most balls. So if you know how many balls there are total and you know how many you have, you can kind of gauge how many your opponents have. Is that right? Let's go over to the camp. We need to pay our bunnies. So now we absolutely need to go out and finish some quests so that we can get some money and also keep an eye out how we can go against the law. If only my parents could see me now. They'd be so proud of the fighter that I'd become. Teach the groups the trick of the trade. Ooh, experience for close companions. Well, all of us are so close together right now. Extra valor or, oh, never mind, aptitude point. Anytime there's an aptitude point, we are taking it. Yeah, let's go with crit. I know it seems weird on a tank, but, you know, maybe they can help out with a DPS too. Who knows? All right, where are we at? Well, there's the boss. Should we push up? I kind of want to do the bandit layer and then move over to the crone's crew. I think that'll be the most profitable. Oh, can we throw a piton even in the thick of things out here? Yes, we can. That is fantastic. Shortcut. Oh, so what I'm going to do, we can take these guys down level seven. I think if we take down their leader, granted, we won't really get loot for it, but we can drop these guys super fast. So if we send someone like Cindy in, she should be able to drop the leader in one go. And then we can just move on to the more important stuff and save our valor points, right? So we'll start with poison. We'll start. Oh, yeah, this is this is going to be over and we'll flip it and shot. It. So I'm curious if they will be demoralized enough to flee because they just lost their boss buff. Not yet. So they're not demoralized completely. And then we should be able to tie that guy up. Oop, hello. There it is. Beautiful. We want to go over to the bandit stronghold because we've taken out all of the packs except for one, which means we will have to deal with reinforcements. But you know what? The way we're going, I feel like we can probably handle it. There it is. And it does have one skull. So they will have reinforcements at the very least. Ambush level eight. We've got 18. Are they all grouped up? Please say they are. One, two, three, 17 and eight. Yes, they are. So this seems like a giant bowling alley. That's what it seems like. So let's try and group as many bunnies on one side as possible, and we'll just clash right through them. Let's go in and get a tank wall up front right here. So we got Tack, we got Sukalanti. Okay, this is looking like a proper battle. This looks so freaking cool. They outnumber us by four. We outnumber them with our spirits. We'll shoot right over our tank's shoulder. Shot. Oh, never mind. That guy's. <laughs> And let's go in and guard the center right here. And who's up next? Okay, he might go into the cone of doom. So we'll just kind of... Oh, he's a he's a shooter, though. Oh, I don't like that. Well, maybe we should get in and drop that guy. Probably better to get a, a nasty striker in there. Because if we can get a follow-up ping, which we are guaranteed to get here, then we can move again and at least go back into safety, right? There it is. <laughs> And the throw, beautiful. Between the eyes, I know it's close range, and holy crap, that guy's dead. Wow. Any more poachers out here? We have one in the distance. We can get there too, apparently. God, he can move anywhere he wants. Burn him. There it is. And the ping. So we didn't quite finish him. That's okay, because we can always run over to the spear. Oh, we got a throw. That resets the movement. We can now move over, toss the spear. <laughs> 
Heck yes. All right. Beautiful. And uh, we're not quite able to get behind the shield wall. We can get behind our bear. So let's do it. Here we go. Wow, that was very effective. That thinned out the crowd by quite a bit. Mostly just lurking, but man, you seem like you got at least that class figured out. It is super helpful to have someone so flexible. We're about to have a tank come in from the opposite side. So we'll stand right here alongside Tugbobo. We'll send out a ping. There we go. This gives brutality to anyone we're in contact with. And I'm actually going to get this and protect uh, tank here. So let's see what happens. We've got two wrongdoers on the move. Oh, and he engages. That's a bit problematic. We didn't have quite enough of a cone uh, and the wrongdoer. Oh, he's flipping it around, moving to engage Tug. Uh-oh. We're getting overwhelmed on one side, I guess. Can anyone reach that far? I know Lummox can. I know Lummox can. So let's do it. We have to help out the other side. Let's put it that way. So we're just going to use a free torch so that we can get a reset to movement. Oh, I guess we might as well finish him. There we go. <laughs> we want to drop that poacher if possible. We'll get a little bit closer. We'll toss out the poison vial. We'll hit three. So that's going to be four stacks on each. Getting close. Burn the burn the poison that guy's out of the turn order take the throw get the reset and then let's pull back we need to reinforce this side we can move right through enemies look at that that's so cool who's after that okay we've got more assaulting the opposite side so i kind of want to prevent that if possible so what i'm going to do we'll aim that'll extend our range we'll get a recoil shot from behind which will at least slow him down just a little bit so we'll take a shot just for good measure and let's pull back to get our point right back if we ping this guy, it'll break the armor. It seems like a waste, but I'm going to do it. I'm going to have Kalania get on in. We'll ping this. Oh. <laughs> a little more than ping. Kalania over the always the overachiever. So she actually gets inspiration. She doubles her movement immediately, and now she can close that gap. That's fantastic. We're coming to our allies rescue right here. We'll come right on through. There it is. Clear that like a total boss. Galvanize, that's a 50% damage buff to the whole team galvanize to get our valor right on back oh this guy's gonna bleed well sukalanti's not fast enough actually when we disengage he is so let's go ahead and taunt so it guarantees we're not gonna get a crit and kill the guy but we will disengage now get the hit boom there's the kill and because it's the first time we disengage and we have an upgraded skill we actually double our movement with inspiration and now we can close the gap where we couldn't hit him before we'll get the shot shot to finish and now all the enemies are grouped over here. There are still reinforcements inbound, so we do have to be aware of that. You love seeing Kalania do the run. She's so good at it. She's so... Let's get right in the thick of things. Let's do it. Here we go. If we do Flaming Strike, we'll tie up the wrongdoer. But better yet, because of the burn, as his allies are next to him, they will take burn to destabilize. We'll break that 40% damage reduction on his guard, and we shall hold position. Everyone's over there now, so fortunately we've got... I don't know if Amiel's AoE Overwatch right here is super useful. Fortunately, everyone has reposition. All the bunnies do. This is going to be our last bunny to move for the turn. And we have reinforcements coming in very soon. I don't know which side they're going to appear on. It'll be great if they just appear right in Amiel's <laughs> his Overwatch zone. All right, where are they at? Oh my god! We've got, we now jumped from 6 to 24. So that was the reinforcement. We are completely surrounded in every direction. So we really need to group up now. It looks like if we put our back to the cliff, we do not have enemies at our back. So falling back to our previous position may be good. Oh my God. Uh, <laughs> okay. We got to break this position and go. Let's disengage. There's a strike right back. Since he's already has no guard, there's going to be a guaranteed crit. A huge crit. Beautiful. And we get the point right back. We can strike again. We should be able to get Wrath. And he loses that opportunity there. Oh, he's so close. So close. I guess we'll finish. Oh, I don't want to do it, but there we go. Shot the finish. I mean, if we get on this side, we can at least flip him. And it's going to use up almost all our valor. But you know what? Them's the breaks. Let's go ahead and try and drop this wrongdoer. She currently has a challenge stance for defense. This is a perfect opportunity if this guy survives. Ah, uh, he's not go Yeah, he's not going to survive. <laughs> well, she could totally get this guy, but then is she going to be stranded? We may need to do a two-tiered retreat. So let's switch over to defensive stance and get an attack of opportunity on the Marauder, and hopefully she'll hit hard enough. She did. Okay, she did. In the distance. Oh, a poacher. The worst person for this. Well, 
let's get Lummox out there. So the wrongdoers, they're going to be the toughest to burn down. So getting poison on them is going to be very helpful. So let's toss that out. Ping him with a torch for free. There's the hit. Get the throw. Reset the movement. And let's get the hit out of dodge. So we can go all the way away and hold. This is going to cost all of our points if I flip it the other way. So I'm going to flip it opposite and hope they close and not push us. We get a point for standing next to our ally. There it is. Shot. <laughs> And it stops him in his tracks. He cannot advance. We've got one more charge of that. Kelania. We can charge through. Heck yeah. <laughs> oh my god. She's coming around. Give him a nice ping. Hopefully we break the armor for lucky. We did not break the armor. So this scoundrel is going to go next. This is where our assassins come into place. We will give him a little bit of bleed. Torch, torch. Well, let's try and get rid of the other scoundrel. We'll give him a ping. That's a big ping and a throw. Oh, so close. We will get the kill and the point. And we get another throw. That resets the movement. Now we get the heck out of dodge. Okay, great job, Tank. Great job. So we'll come around. We'll just get a regular old ping. Oh, never mind. Oh, that'll do. 214. He's an AOE guy, but apparently he also kills people in single, single target. What if we move to assist and just drop the wrongdoer? or at least do some damage, tie him up. Rampage would definitely finish him. But now we are out of Valor. We're completely dry. Probably going into Tug. Nope, nope, he's going into the wall. There it is. That's our last poke. That's going to stop him in position, but that is our last defensive poke on the pike wall. So who's up next? Going to be the wrongdoer behind. Then it's going to be a wrongdoer on the opposite side. So this is really the threat right here. So if we wanted to take that guy out, I'm thinking Cindy might be the best so we'll go ahead and send some arterial precision there it is beautiful and we need to move to assist give him a nice oh there it is <laughs> if the enemy groups up and the field is clear kalania is going to go ham i right, relocate i think she's going to get the most bang for her buck if she can oh she can get two all right oh my, oh my god Oh, she freed everybody. Oh, yeah, free the bunnies. Let's go. Okay, well, that worked. Oh, wow. Talk about threading the needle. And the third point shot the finish. We get inspiration. We strike back to kill to the enemy. Oh, demoralized and flee? Sure, we'll be merciful. All right, we did it. Heck yes. Wow, that was pretty brutal. This is awesome. We get extra armor. We also take 90% damage less from shooting blueprint a beehive say what now we can make beehives we've got this cage help us please don't... i beg of you in the name of the eye oh, oh we have an ornate cage. key let's go back to our people at the sawmill oh the sawmill oh, thank you mercenaries wow okay great and who is this i don't concern myself with local affairs is this the black market oh my god we found the black market <laughs> We found the black market. All right. Well, these are stolen, though, aren't they? Oh, they're cheaper. They're usually 360. Looter's torch. Oh, hello. So at the very least, we'll take first aid. We'll take run. Oh, we're out of money. Oh, no. <laughs> and we can sell some stuff. No problem. Damage dagger. Sell the old helm. So I think that's all good. And now we should have enough for run and let us hold. Although I would like this, too. All right. Beautiful. So we're going to have to launder these, I think, because they're counting as stolen. And we will put in our camp chest all of the red items so that they can be laundered. Now we need Lummox, who is our thief, and we shall assign him to do the dirty deed. Heck yes. So now it's just eat because we're about to head out to potentially the boss and kind of like a special bounty. Yes. I love that they got you with an impulse purchase too. Oh, they did. That's right. We need to get out to the old crone and then the boss. Can bears wear armor? Oh my God. What is this? Derelict farm. Oh, we're being attacked by Crocswine. Trap door here. I would love to get an elephant with elephant armor. They always look so cool. Kind of reminds me of what was the, uh, there was, oh, what the heck? We found a smuggler's hideout. Oh, we, didn't the trackers want us to take out the smugglers? We stumbled across this by accident. Oh, that's why there's valuables here. Holy crap. But does anyone remember there is a toy line, like an action figure line with dinosaurs wearing armor? I don't remember what it's called, but I thought they were so cool. 
So when you see a bear with armor, that's immediately what I think of. And I think there was a T-Rex and he had lasers on his helmet thing. He Dino Riders, sounds about right. Ones providing the people of Harag with plague remedies. Oh, so they're currently holding on to the cure for the plague in this region? I'm looking for a way out of Ludern. So if we accept, we get the tail of the wolf and the hop. That's food and two cures for the plague. Or we can attack them like the trackers wanted us to. I think we shall attack Wait. them. We work for the trackers now. In any game with elephants, they are my favorite. Heck yes. Actually, what other games have elephants? That's so cool. They're always like war elephants, yeah? Challenging shout. Bring them in and then spin it to win it. Here we go. In Warhammer Fantasy. Oh, heck yes. They've got elephants. We were just talking about beasts of war, like elephants and, well, dinosaurs. <laughs> Dinosaurs as well. Yes, it's it's true. I was playing War Tales. We're grinding right now. Everything's going good except, you know, being wanted. Well, here's the thing. If you're wanted, then you should be able to pick fights with the guards, right? We haven't really done that just yet, but we are hoping to do so. Breaking the law. That's right. We're breaking the law, debts. And this is what you were talking about with the Warhammer Cold Ones. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. Wow. Can you imagine making armor for a T-Rex? <laughs> Look at this. I mean, I mean, think about this. Look, look at this. Its claw has its own articulating armor. That is so cool. <laughs> like, you definitely need to be a master of craftery. Yeah? Just pouring molten metal over a T-Rex. What's the craftsmanship about it? <laughs> well, I'm sure it'll be just fine with it. All right. Well, we took out the smuggler's hideout. Hopefully the trackers are happy. Oh, we got Croc Swine. Okay. All right. We get Croc Swine scales. Amazing. We get Grease Superior. Now level 10. That's fantastic. Dodging enemy range in AoE, especially if you're standing still for a while. That seems incredible too. So since we're super, super defensive, I think the alacrity might be better. And for our rangers, obviously, they've got unstoppable. I love Tug's suggestion, and I think we should definitely have Tug Bear Bear. Yeah, <laughs> that is amazing. Well, let's move. We got to move on to this. This is a special crew right here. So they've got your regular assassinations, things like that. But this one, this one is the old crone's crew. She's actually named, which is kind of scary. What is this? Is this the Brotherhood? Oh, it's the Brotherhood training ground. Amazing. We know these guys. Nice. What? This is a new strategy. Your beasts now deal 10% more damage. Oh my god. That's so... I didn't know this existed. What? Well, we're definitely going to buy that. My god, that's amazing. We're so low on gold right now just because we got to turn all this in. We'll definitely grab that. That's crazy. I wonder which slot that takes. Because depending on which rank it's in, I mean, that's super useful, right? So we'll go back over to the camp. We'll go over to the strategy table and oh, it's on the first layer. So right now it's 10% on attacks of opportunity or 10% for your beasts. I don't know if we have enough beasts that this will be super useful. Whereas there's a lot of people with attacks of opportunity, but gosh, that's so cool. If you want to flex that way, that's amazing. Yeah. Oh, look, it's the last bandit crew. They're about to find out that they don't have any friends anymore. All right, into the mine. Oh, what is going on here? Do we have... Are these Mormons or something? Can I take your ore? Oh, yeah, we can take their ore. That's great. Or maybe Amish. You destroyed the barricade because you're going to check if there's anything inside the... Yeah. Tree. You won't leave us to deal with this on our own, will you? Well, I'm not going to say yes or no, but you can count on us to do something. Oh, look, more ore. Well, here's the thing. I guess we could check, but I mean, what if it's just like, I don't know, a rat or something? All right, we'll go and look. Jeez Louise. And everywhere we go, we're like the police or, you know. Oh, they are rats. What is this? Rats. There's, tw there's 20 rats? Oh, boy. Wow, that's a lot of rats. Um. Well, they've got 82 healthy. Those are big rats. Holy crap, these are big rats. I stand corrected. Well, here's the thing. I think rats burn, right? Our lady of blessed AoE, don't fail us now. Well, you know what? That's going to be Kalania all the way. Come on, Kalania. Give him a nice cross bleed. This kind of reminds me of crosswords. You know, crosswords, they've got your horizontal and vertical rows. Well, you know, it's a little bit the same. This is like our version of Sudoku and War Tales or something. There we go. Line that up. Beautiful. And I think they do take poison. So we'll just do this. Yep. 
Yep, that'll do it. Yep, that'll do it. Give them a little bit of burn. Oh, they're demoralized. All right, we did it, I guess. <laughs> we only need to kill 13. All right, look at all these rat corpses. We killed 13, but we got 15 rat bodies. Big Brick is now level 10. Fantastic. So he, on the other hand, needs to get into position as best he can. I'm thinking Unstoppable would be good for Big Brick. So we actually did clear it for those people. Burn their nest. Moo rats. Curses. We get iron ore. We get a pan. I will take a pan. What is the pan? Do we cook things? Do we smack people in the head with it? Do we get crotchety? Has a chance of increasing the amount of ore gathered. Oh, hello, nurse. Oh, wait, are these? Is this the target? Oh, this is the target. I stand corrected. And wait a minute. Is that a secondary tunnel? Oh, when we went through the mine. Hang on. There's another tunnel on the opposite side. Oh, it dumps us on the... Oh, my God. Actually, did we find a secret? I feel like right now, this is kind of like Zelda, and as we come out, it goes... Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> oh, hello, fragment of a small item. All right, we did discover a secret. Amaze balls. But apparently, it's uh, just a little peninsula out here. Well, that's cool. We all like peninsulas. I mean, most people like peninsulas. I, I won't say all of us like peninsulas, even though I just said it. That's okay.